uh, welcome back to another video. I need to get like a thing to say at the opening. Yeah, anyways. Hi, welcome back to another video. As you can see, today we're making a sketchbook. Since the uh, this is, yeah. Yes, this is already a sketchbook, but we're going to be making a sketchbook out of the paper in the sketchbook. Because if you know me, I don't like spiral bound. Um, I, I use them for other things. I take the paper out of them and I use them. Um, so yeah, I have a cracker box from last night. And yeah, I'm not going to make it that thick. Don't worry, I'll make it thinner. Um, I'll go through it at everything I'm doing uh, in the voiceover. Um, yeah, this isn't really a tutorial because I kind of just fudge it. Like, that's probably why they turn out kind of shitty, but anyways, yeah, I don't really use one method. Um, I've watched a couple of like, videos about them, and I kind of just sew the, the signatures in, um, kind of randomly, and hope for the best. So, yeah, if you want to actually make like, a decent slash book, and then I recommend finding a tutorial. Oh my god, my hair. And then I recommend finding a tutorial that's, like, good. An actual tutorial and works. Um, so yeah, let's just, just get into it. It'll be all sped up because I don't want to do this in real time. Alright, so this is the voiceover. <laughs> um, yeah, uh, so first thing I'm doing is, like, cutting up the box to make it uh, a better size for a sketchbook. I don't want that big. Um... Normally, I, the way I did this one, um, this was really weird, and probably do later, I got even that box in more, um, with the main section on that, but yeah, uh, I just rip out the paper, uh, or, yeah, that's, that's all you do. Uh, this step where I'm, like, tearing the, uh, edges off, if you don't, like, if you just use, like, loose sheets of paper, then you probably don't have to do this. This is, like, in my opinion, one of the most boring steps, because you're just ripping stuff off of paper. Um, yeah, there's not really much to say about this. This sketchbook I made, pretty small, uh, I think it had four signatures, what, three each? It's twelve, if you use the front and back, that's what. Um, hmm. wait, no, wait, let me do the math here. Fold them in half to make, I think that's 48 pages? Yeah, oh, yeah, here just folding the paper in half, because you gotta do that. Um, yeah, and then you make your signatures. I made, like I said, four. They each have three in them. Um, like three folded pieces of paper. Yeah. Uh, this video is pretty short. There's not really much to it, because it's not a tutorial. It's just another thing. Um, yeah. Uh, poke hole. So it makes it easier to sew. Um, I find sewing the, like, the least interesting part of making a sketchbook. I don't know, a lot of people enjoy it, I don't know, it's really repetitive, it takes kind of a long time. Um, yeah, oh yeah, uh, I just, that's, it. the needle I was using is, like, one that's made for, like, embroidery thread. You can use ones with, like, normal thread, but I find that those, like, they rip easier because like the thread is just thinner and not as strong so i just use embroidery thread um yeah i have a bunch of it lying around uh that i used to make stuff with but i just look at anyone and so just use the strokes anyways yeah just one the picture there's a bunch of them to definitely go out if i want to sketch on your own um like i said at the start i just kind of made this up as i went because i've sold sketchbooks in the past and i used I used methods that were a lot more similar to like um, actual methods. And so there, so I, I, I did like tutorial method, method, method for this one because I knew just, as long as you sew them in, they should theoretically stay in. So yeah, you're just gluing the covers on. As you can see, I cut them up for some odd reason. Um, yeah. Usually I'd have like one long piece of cardboard that just wraps around and then have to do this. But like I said, I think today I was feeling a little funky. And so I was like, let's just completely freehand this, you know, not freehand, freeform. I don't know what the word is. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much how you make a sketchbook. Sketchbox, sketchbook. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope... 
this encouraged you or motivated you to make a sketchbook of your own, they're really fun. Go find the tutorial that is an actual tutorial and the person knows what they're doing uh, so yours can look good. Again, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching and please remember to stay safe and don't die. Bye!